Please remove those. Hey everyone, coming to you from an elevator. Haven't done one of those videos in a while. Um, I love how many people continually still tell me about how much they enjoyed the footage that Howard and I shared over the years and the talks we've given. Uh, big props to Howard Payne. He talked to me before I put this video together for you. I had a couple quick questions and he was instrumental as always. Really, really smart cat. I love sharing obscure elevator facts and some of you enjoy them. So yes, what is a California compliant elevator? And am I in one? I don't know that I am actually. Looks like Innovation Bruiser series, but I don't know if these would be California compliant buttons because it's not having to do with where the elevator is. In fact, most of the footage I showed you at the beginning of this video, a lot of it was California compliant. Very little of it was shot in California. Maybe you can guess where. I'll give you the answers at the end. But no, uh, California building code, like many local regional building codes, has its own quirks and unique features. In California, elevator buttons must be projecting buttons. The fixtures actually have to project out of the panel or the wainscoting. Uh, I believe it's an eighth of an inch minimum. Some fixtures project a little more. There's all different ways of going around this, but California compliant fixtures or California buttons are a thing that you see in many parts catalogs. It's fun too, because like Elevator Products Co. and a few others, they have like the New York series and the Florida series. To my knowledge, that's not specifying a code compliance issue there. A lot of times New York buttons, I think Howard would tell you like housing, like New York housing line, those are like the real vandal resistant feature buttons, but specifically California compliant fixtures, or if you see them in catalogs, California buttons, they are projecting buttons. And it's an accessibility issue as you might have experienced. Sometimes you'll have buttons that you're like, am I really pushing it or am I not? Or can I feel if you're blind or low vision, can you find where the button is? Giving people a little bit of extra feedback on where the button is located and whether they pressed it correctly, that's a good thing in my mind. So there you go. That's what a California compliant elevator fixture looks like. And here's the answers if those of you want to guess if you were right or wrong about the buttons at the beginning. Please remove those. All right. Hope you enjoyed this one. I had a good time uh, telling you little facts like this. Wherever you are, wherever you go, stay safe out there. How do you do? You got it. You were going down there? No, I was going up. Oh, no, you're good. You're good. <laughs> right on. Well, have a good day. Thank you. It's always nice to interact with the security guard of a building you broke into so you could film some elevator footage.